happen over here? We don't want to fight both these together. We want to take them as two separate fights. So just wait. There we go. We do want the Reavers, though. We want their weapons. That's unfortunately a hammer, which I don't like. I don't really like the Barbarian Mace either, honestly, but it's just better than not having a mace at all. Barely. And those are fucking money in the bank, the javelins. If I go there and finish that guy off, there'll be no one for him to swing on. Adrenaline just murders these tiny fights. It's actually ridiculous. Shit, I'm supposed to walk forward and swing. Mistakes. Okay. Um, I keep getting told the answer, Puri, and forgetting immediately. So the answer is yes, someone figured it out, and I should know, but I don't right now. Fuck just pulled out a goddamn thing after adrenaline. He did not go first there, by the way. Yeah, someone said in chat that Adrenaline was just plus a thousand uh, initiative. I don't know if that's true or not. I'd really like to avoid taking wounds right now. by swamp movement. Bastards. Oh. 
Bit of big, a uh, bit of both. Wow. I'm doing it by brother. Some of the brothers have had like some of our cultists have had 49 HP and some have had like 65. So I'm kind of just waiting to see. This guy does not really want to fight this guy, but that's what we got going on. Extra drop. Like to have known what was there, but I'm not spending the night there. We have to go back here. We already got our 20 heads, so we definitely want to get paid. All right, anything in here? This is uh, I think that's optimistic. I think we're just gonna let that one be. All right, we have two famed well. 27 there. A little light on food. Man, what are they buying for here? This is selling for 235. What the fuck? Buying for 17 at shitty Swamp Town? Hell yeah. I don't know why I carry this around like I'm going to use this. I hate the two handed non famed scimitars, they're just not good. I'm done with flails. It's probably a few too many jabs. I think we saved those for a rebuilding effort. Okay. Anything else to do while we're here? Drunk scavenger, wrestle a weapon beset with gems from a dead man's hand some way to the west. That is a famed weapon rumor. I need some of these events to trigger. Go, I agree. I agree. Let's give me any more information first. It says dead man's grip, so presumably a zombie. Same. When I pay again, I get the same rumor. Nice. Good work, game. Thanks for, thanks for making that clear. All right. Wow. Well, I need to. How do I tell this? If uh, where's that? Did he leave channel?
All right, I guess we're going west here. We need a little bit more food before we go. Uh, dude, I do not want to pay 114 for food, but I want to be able to roam out there a minute without having to come back, so let's do it. All right, to the west. It's quite a ways, honestly. Undead to the west. Seems promising. Okay. All right, who do we not want to bring for this fight? We do have whips. We don't know what's in here. It could be guys. It's absolutely true. We have somebody else cleaver spec too. It's this guy. So he's a pretty good candidate for sitting up front with the whip to begin with. All right, who do we not want to bring? I think Lullaways wants to be here. I have dreams of that guy being useful one day. Okay. After two days from last event, hover camp button. It should show event if it's non-zero. Yeah, but we've been doing that, and at no point has it ever done that. Right? There's no hover, anything. So I keep trying to catch him in channel so he can respond to that, because that's what he said from what you're saying is what he said for sure. But well, we haven't had any events for days, right? Like, anyone remember any events that have triggered recently? Because I don't remember any. All right, is it time to level one of our other guys? We've got a lot of people who could die and I'd be all right with that right now. I wonder if I should bring one of them specifically to die in here. Uh, this is another good one to roll with. Had a cultist join? It's three days or the cooldown, or every three days are when your events can trigger, I believe. Right, how the fuck am I gonna kill this asshole? Necro, and there's gonna be a necro here, right? Stats make a good banner and why? Um, melee attack, resolve, and fatigue with enough HP to stay alive. Um, because the banner doesn't do any web damage because it doesn't scale relative to your other weapons. So you want it to be utility. The utility things a banner can do are um, obviously rally, but also disarm. So melee skill for hitting with disarms. Then. Uh, the rest says that we just talked about. All right, let's go see what's in here. 21. Do you had to buy the X packs in order? Um, I think the biggest content ad is the Desert Sands. I think the other good one is Northern Raiders. Um, the Hunter one's kind of medium and the free DLC, of course, is a free DLC. So no complaints, but also not adding that much. Uh, I don't want to... Dude, I don't want these. I think this is back. Why are there more zombies up here? Oh, no. Okay, that's a little closer than I was hoping to find zombies. Three is something. I haven't seen the Geist buff or the um, Necro buff, so maybe it's just Geist. Okay. 
Thanks, Greenzer. Tier 3 sub, 22 months. Much appreciated. Hey. Hey, indeed. Alright, this is looking like three guys and zombies, but we could be horribly wrong. It's absolutely possible to be horribly wrong here. Could also be nachos. There's only three. I think I nachos spawn minimum of four, but maybe it's possible. I don't know. nachos. I've never seen three nachos. I assume the minimum nacho spawn was four. Interesting. Dude, they're arming themselves. Fucking zombies. It looked like I made a really skilled play there by killing the backline threat and then switching for a second attack. I had no fucking idea. No idea that guy had two attacks. I'm like, oh, that's a nice exchange. A nice surprise. Okay. But I would deny that if asked. I absolutely knew what I was doing. Can't prove otherwise. I missed Confident. I'm really glad it's back. It's a surprisingly huge debuff to not have Confident. A new subscriber. Greens are gifted a sub. Thanks. Welcome, Loxorus. Greens are two gifted a tier one sub to Loxorus. They have given 222 gift subs in the channel.
quitters never win. Oh, I don't know what there anymore. Rip. Pack advice. Thanks, Flopsy. Appreciate the sub. Hope you enjoy the game. Hope you have a lot of fun with it. I've had thousands of hours of fun in this game. Because it's a really good one. Alright, give me that legendary weapon. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. That tactically is a weapon. I guess. I guess it's okay. Seems actually pretty good. I gotta compare it to uh, the other stuff. Okay, but that's probably the weapon, right? So now we can go north and see what's around. Ten more zombies. Greens are leveled again. All right, hit nimble on Greenzer. We got Sir Flipper. And Tragic Booty leveled. Still in? Yeah. Yep. You're going to be the replacement banner when this banner dies. Ah, chat. I don't want to fight these fucking zombies. But I absolutely should. They are so tedious, but it's free experience for a group of low-level people still leveling to move towards better outcomes, so we absolutely should do it. It's fucking tedious as all hell. Alright, set up to let's give them like a little area they can move into that we can attack. Here we go. Had to refresh. Thanks, Drew. We are building an army. Thank you for the five gifted subs, Greenser. Should they have an auto resolve? I don't think so. But, I mean, how are they going to calculate it? Like your wounds? It's going to be like auto resolve in every other game. You're going to be like, excuse me, I fought four zombies and I have eight mortal wounds. I lost a pair of fingers on every single brother. This doesn't seem reasonable.
There's so much positioning in Battle Brothers. Like, you could fuck up a fight, even as an overwhelmingly powerful fight. Do it all the time with orcs. Especially if you're not paying attention or you're just a little tired or some version of that. Just try to do adrenaline. Good about confident and anatomist. Uh, confidence says stat boost. It's just right now it's a 10% stat boost to all relevant stats, which is really fucking great. Anatomist can't be confident. Greatest fight of all time. I guess we sell garbage here again. They were buying at 17 last time we we're here. Don't know if that's still the case. Yeah, looks like it. So we should definitely sell everything we don't want. I'm not sure if that includes the weapon I just sold or not. Do we have two bows? Do. Okay. All right, let's go up this way. Um, we gotta work on that then while you, uh, not like you and I or like for the mod. I mean, we just have to pay attention. Could be good. I think these are, okay, so these can't be converted. Wait, the scam trains over here. Nice. Okay, ailing is not super good for us. Poacher. I, dumb, but already the background we can convert. Not good enough there either. Do we want this guy? I think until we get a conversion event, we've been a long time without a conversion event right now. I'm a little concerned. I'm always a little concerned the mod is not working. Might just be paranoia. All right, what's this? Caravan we don't want. Grave robbers. Do we care? I think it's too early for trying out random backgrounds while. I mean, I guess I should look at the cost. What is the cost? 174, eh, maybe. Event chance 14%. So the, whatever this mod is, is working. Is that, what is that for? Davkul or uh, sacrifice or conversion or both or either, any event. How can it be a 13% chance of any event? Who knows? All right, let's go up here. It's a brawler. That's a higher. OK. 
Okay. How do you roll? Max rolled his melee defense. Middle rolled his melee attack. Actually, low rolled his melee attack. Low rolled his HP. Low rolled his fatigue. High rolled his resolve. Still good. Pessimist is a bit of a bitch, but oh well. Okay, we're starting to actually have a bit of a glut of people, mostly because the conversion vents are not triggering right now. We really kind of need them to start triggering. These people have been attacked by Alps. I think we just hit Daybreak, which is kind of a bummer. Rebuilding effort here. I think it does not impact cost. Although it's only buying at 15. Yeah. Check logs to see what event chance. Um, maybe. I don't really want to at this moment. I don't want to stay around for that and the Alps aren't here. Go. When any event fires, check logs. Okay. All right. Well, we just had an event trigger. This is the sacrifice event. We just hired somebody. Who do you guys want to meet Davkul? Pyro is a very unexceptional level one cultist, and Ulrich is one of our indebted. I think we should keep Ulrich around. I think we should feed Pyro to Davkul. Goodbye, Pyro. Nom, nom, nom. Okay, Pyro's dead. A couple guys got angry because the conversion events haven't triggered. So we've got, hold on, don't just run the game. Why does it not auto pause? Are you fucking kidding me right now? All right. Does uh, the guy who prevents desertion prevent this? We have one powder right now, chat. Who do we want to powder? Also, is there a tavern? There is a tavern. Let's hit the tavern right now. Lolo is disgruntled out of that. Let's pay again. Who the fuck is Husano something or another? So two tavern hits there. We missed... The brawler, oh, the brawler was Ulrich. I thought it was one of our, interesting, okay. So we're gonna keep Lullaways, but one of these two will leave. Who do you want, chat? Do we wanna gamble on our lumberjack, our brute lumberjack, missing melee defense stuff, or our brawler? I think we should probably, um, That's how it is, right? Indebted, D-E-B-T, yeah. Okay. And the problem is our indebted are higher level than our fucking other guys is the problem. Okay. All right, keep Ulrich. All right, we need a name for Ulrich then. I think Tragic's gonna abandon us. All right, let's pop the happy powder here. Just bad timing on that event, truly. I was kind of excited to see how this brother rolled, honestly. Okay. Uh, the drinks cap at two. I believe the third one doesn't hit anybody new, right? I'll check one more time for science, but pretty sure it just gets your existing. I think you can only get two rounds of people covered. Anyway. All right. No, well, rip. If we can get a fight real quick, we can bring it back. We have to find a fight immediately. Well, that would work. We can bring him into that fight and not lose him. That'd be good. Yeah, yeah I'm kind of excited by this brother too. All right, we have to treat this as potentially undead, which are not good for us. But there you are. All right, uh, we want to bring Tragic Booty into this fight.
I want to send someone with them to kill. I guess it could be Hoppala. We have a priest of Davkol. No, we're not even close to that. We're uh, that was our. We just hit third. Three candles is what we just hit, which is fatigue recovery. That's our highest candle count. Okay. Don't really care if he's. I mean, I do care if he's injured. He'll get cranky about it for sure. All right, fifteen. Don't know what they are yet. Obviously. This is really bad terrain for fighting Geisen. They'll just hide behind the pillars and yell at us. So we just want to back up. Kind of want to go three back. So I think I will. If there's a necro going up is not good. We want to go forward. But I don't know what it is yet, so. Does GTN not have fucking Pathfinder? Are you kidding me? We can't have him off chasing fucking necros by himself without Pathfinder. It's just not going to work. All right. Somebody missed a point there. Just guys. I don't see a necro. Okay. All right. So we move the line one forward. Those will come forward still. up there that's actually so bad yeah. you know what else adrenaline wrecks by the way is guys Almost killed himself. I think I should just build adrenaline on all my early liner, all my early gamers, like regardless of the playthrough. I think it's just too good to pass up in the early game like this. It's just unlocking so many camps. I 
I'm absolutely certain I pulled out a fucking shield here. I keep trying to rally him. Is he just set to we can't go above it? Is that the issue right now? Yeah. I keep trying to rally him though. Like, because I'm not understanding how that worked. For some reason, I was thinking he started at that, but not that he had to stay at it. But he did have to stay at it, so. Doesn't go ahead of the respawns. I was kind of curious. Alright. Not bad. Jesus. Alright. Take it. Alright, how did that go? Tragic Booty is fine. He leveled up. Didn't take any wounds. Rolled a four. Shit's back on track. Good work. All right, easy pathfinder. Fencer rolls. Does this have to be resolve or HP? Okay. All right, let's keep moving. Don't want to be surprised by unholds right now. A little low on food. Should take that camp. Okay, this guy does not. We need to get somebody over there as fucking Pathfinder. Chaos could do it. Okay. Anyone's armor get fucked up? Not really. These people good. Yeah, these people are fine. Couple people not super happy, but another fight should be good for them. Okay. Anyone leave? No, no one left. All right. I'm gonna grab another drink, chat. Back a sec. Wait, why did no one tell me my webcam wasn't back on? <laughs> Rip. All right, we've returned. We made it back. Cheers, chat. And what do we have? We don't know what we have yet, so let's find out. There's fallen heroes here and proper armored zombies.
I don't think it's a necro, and I don't think this strategy works versus a necro. I think we gotta go back to bringing some dogs to these. Pull those guys forward if it is guys early. Just an arming sword on that guy and a hat. His hat's okay, 230 or something, guys up there. Okay, we're probably backing up with these two. guys. No necro. Well, that guy just wants to walk in there and die. That's okay. She really tempted to go for that one too. But we won't. I hope I'm not under committing to these guys. I could, have, I could have dove them there, but it's a bunch of armored zombies. I didn't really want to be out of the line position for this. The line blocks um, the zombies from spawning and pushing you in a different direction along there's no corpses underneath you. If you're like spread out through there, they can A, move through you, and B, you can get spawned deeper and deeper and get screwed sometimes. Get to that one right now. Don't think anyone else says rotate here either. Okay. Yeah, non rally there. It's okay at the moment. We haven't named him yet. Why have we not named him yet? I need to pull the shield out. Dude, what's going on with this guy? Why does he get hit every single attack? These are fucking zombies. And also he just never goes either. Like, is he, has he had a turn? No. He's gonna go last this turn. He's absolutely fucked too. Good luck.
Have to save their rally in case this guy gets hit once and breaks. Just use my banner. Shouldn't have done that. If he gets hit and panicked before his turn, it's actually really bad. I don't think there's a reason to risk this guy next to that zombie. Okay. Well, got a little sketchy there for a minute, but seemed to be okay in the end. <laughs> 